First, though, guidelines to reopen the country, the president laying it out in three phases, what this all means for Florida. Good afternoon. Thanks for joining us on this Friday. I'm Justin Warman. I'm Bridget Ellison. The president's guidelines were unveiled as Governor Ron DeSantis forms a task force here. And as News Six's Mark Lehman explains, the governor says the guidelines will be tailored to local needs. When it comes to the plan for reopening businesses in Florida, there are really a lot of things that are up in the air right now. Governor DeSantis spoke briefly on the issue today, but there are still many questions about what's next. Speaking in South Florida this morning, Governor Ron DeSantis talked about how things will likely be different from one part of the state to the next in terms of getting people back to work. We do need to get to a next phase. Maybe Southeast Florida looks a little different than the rest of the state, um, and I think that that would make sense. DeSantis says he will follow the guidelines laid out by the White House on Thursday, but things will also be tailored to local needs. It doesn't mean that we're going to Florida is going to go every single thing they say or not say, but but that's a pretty good baseline. Those guidelines state that for an area to reach the first phase, it should show a downward trajectory of cases for 14 days, ability to treat patients without overwhelming hospitals and have a testing program in place for health care workers. As of now, some areas in Florida are approaching those criteria. So I think what you're seeing is, is progress is being made. Uh, the hospitalizations uh, have, been, have been relatively flat. Now, as far as a timeline for all of this, DeSantis previously said that nothing is set in stone and he will be watching for how things are trending. DeSantis is set to meet for the first time with his task force for reopening the economy today. We will keep you updated with what happens. For now, reporting in the newsroom, Mark Lehman, getting results, News 6.